Hey guys, so here's another um, show I'm going to start reacting to, uh, Convenience Store Boyfriends, and this is episode 3, June. So, without further ado, let's take a look and see what happens. So we've got one of our main characters running to meet someone, I guess, maybe. Where's he going? Oh, here's the convenience store. Must admit, the title confused me at first when I first started watching this. I thought you can buy boyfriends at convenience stores now. <laughs> but obviously, that was just silly. He's running late. 14 days until the 32nd Sports Festival. Okay. I wonder if he's going to enter. Whoops. What's with the mark? Around his mouth area. What was that all about? I hope I guess we'll soon find out. Better get to class. Don't want to be late. <laughs> right. Is this a new opening? Or am I just forgetting? It's been a while since I've watched the previous episodes, so I took a small break. So I can't remember if there was a different opening last time. Might have to double check that. Or maybe I'm just imagining it. Anyway. It's still an okay opening. Yeah, it's a different opening, after only three episodes. Why would you change the opening only, three, only after three episodes? It's like, this is not going to be a, a 25, 27 episode series like, say, Sakura uh, Crest, but... Like, Sakura Crest makes sense to have two openings, but this... Huh. June. I guess we're going to go through all the months of the year, for, especially if this is 12 episodes. <coughs> he looks exhausted. Hakuri, that's it. What's going on? Better just slow down and just start explaining. Sorry. Saw another boy. Can't remember the guy's name. Can't remember if he's been introduced yet. So he jumps to conclusions.
<laughs> Is this looking after you? Like looking out for you? Jeez, I don't have to be so pushy about it. Are you going to be thinking about it? And overthink it? <laughs> Looking out the window and contemplating your existence and your other thoughts. <laughs> That's true. You're overthinking it, mate. Don't. He's going to confront him now. Monica, don't do that. Don't do anything rash. He's going to do something rash. Oh, there's a teacher now. Yeah, you know got the teacher. Oh, come on, you're a teacher. Aren't you a teacher? Seriously. So the student council president runs this class, then and the teachers do nothing. You got yourself into this. You might as well talk yourself you're out of it. <clears throat> Meanwhile. What, the cakes don't give it away? <laughs> then aren't you you're officially not a club? You need more than two people to be a club. Why don't you go talk to Masaki about it then? If you Yeah. 
He's making a fuss about nothing I really need to bet. <laughs> Don't drag her al along, come on. Isn't it the teacher's job? The other matter. <laughs> well, I don't really know how Japan sorts out its problems in school. Well, I really thought it would be the teacher's job, not the student council, but anyway. Why are you, anyway? You're overthinking it. <laughs> real, real boys? Oh man, do you guys probably witness something that will make you very embarrassed? 405. That's a good It can't be coarse anyway, see? See? Why don't you just ask him for instead of running about, following him, spying on him, crying out loud? <laughs> Not going to get anywhere like that. I guess that explains the mark on his face though. He's been probably been punched in the right, right hand side of the mouth. Wait. Sorry, left hand side of the face. You're telling me okay, they're fighting over probably nothing. <coughs> Don't you just swim? Yeah. That's easy, yeah. Right, how did he get dragged into this anyway? He didn't do anything. He just witnessed it. Food? 
for them. Or just for him. <laughs> and it's raining. That's a lot of rain. <laughs> He's gonna be soaked when he gets to the convenience store. At least there's an umbrella there. <laughs> there's umbrellas right in front of you. <laughs> How did you not see that? Oh, they're sold out, but there's two there. Oh, okay. <laughs> they can share the umbrella now to get home. <coughs> oh, right, she's got one too. Never mind. I'm not athletic at all. I used to play hockey when I was younger, but and did sailing, but that was about it. <laughs> uh, and there's nothing to talk about. And I won't say it's awkward though. I really do like the pattern of that umbrella that she has. Oh, come on, man. Oops. <laughs> Where is she going? I'm oh, getting some water from the tap. <laughs> Oops. They're very cute together. It's not raining. Ugh. 
I guess that kind of makes it more romantic for them. <laughs> I really do like the animation, the animation style. It's like, there's some scenes that are like really well done, and while others may be a bit too, uh... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, doing research by <laughs> oh, Okay <laughs> Yeah, he was already he already knows that <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> he ended up. <laughs> oh, we're back to the to her again. Why do I have a feeling something bad's about to happen? That's usually the case, when some, a girl's walking alone in a park. She got a... F okay, she so received a phone call. I'm really bet it's bad news. Or it's going to cause drama in the next episode. <coughs> that was a reasonably okay episode. <coughs> <laughs> Both the um, singer for the opening and the ending actually really sounds good, actually. It's very nice to listen to. <laughs> Still the same ending, so... Nothing's changed there, but it's just the opening that's, I think, has changed. <coughs> I don't think we've even met all the characters yet. I think there's still some we have yet to be introduced. They're probably coming off in the next few episodes. <laughs> July. <coughs> what, it hasn't started already? <laughs> Alright, let's wait a moment. Wait, just wait for this to load and then I'll pause it. And then I'll stop. Come on. Okay. <clears throat> and that was an okay episode. Um, we got a bit of backstory on a few of the characters. Um, White-haired guy is, I guess, part of the cooking... Well, is part of the cooking club, even though it's only, you know, what's two members. So it's not really a club. Because I, I believe you need more than four people to, jo to have an actual official club at a school. So, <clears throat> that's the case here, but anyway, we won't get, in, get in too much into that. 
So if you've also been watching Convenience Store Boyfriends, um, let me know your thoughts about the series so far, and you can follow me on Twitter as well. Um, I'll leave a description, uh, leave a link in the description. I keep saying that in the wrong order, but anyway, um, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.